Good afternoon and welcome to Insight with Pape Masa. I'm here to give you your insight today. So if you've interacted with um, Hindus or rather Indians, you realize that they don't take meaty stuff, they don't take eggs and onion and garlic doesn't constitute um, their recipe. So Insight with Pape Masa is here to give you insight into that today. And uh, to begin with, they have a spiritual tale that goes that during the separation of the ocean, I don't want to go into much detail as to why the ocean was being separated, but if you're rather interested you can go check it online so during the separation of the ocean uh lord vishnu was giving um almonds let me call it nectar but there was something that lord vishnu was giving to gods so that they can uh, become immortal so uh, during that process there are also two demons that were present during um the giving and they mistakenly received the nectar so lord vishnu discovered that way uh, later they had already received the nectar and so on discovering that she separated their heads from the rest of their bodies uh, meaning that she beheaded them and when they were beheaded um their heads became immortal but the rest of their body was destroyed and it is believed that the blood that uh, came from the beheading dropped on the ground and it is from there that onions and garlic um came about and that is why um it's considered uh, dark or rather demonic. That is why they don't uh, take onion and also garlic. But another reason is there are three classifications of uh, foods according to Hinduism. We have uh, sattvic, we have uh, rajasic, and uh, tamasic. So um, the recommended type is the sattvic, which is light and healthy food that... Uh, purifies the body and also calms the mind. On the other hand, the Rajasik and the Tamasik are regarded to uh, prevent mental clarity and also slow down the functioning of the brain. And so uh, because of that, they hinder spiritual endeavors by taking away your focus. And that is why um, onion and garlic are not recommended.